Tax Advantages for Internet Marketers Before you read the article, I must make sure to tell you that before you use any of this advice always check with a certified accountant to make sure that this is possible for you as laws vary from jurisdictions whether that be state or national laws. This article is intended as a general guideline only. Things that you can write off include mortgage costs. If you're doing your business from home, Generally, it would be based on either a percentage of the floor space used or percentage of the rooms used in the house or apartment. And this is if the room you are using is used regularly and exclusively for business purposes internet costs. Obviously, as an internet marketer you're using the internet to conduct your business. Why not use the write-off against the income? With a lot of internet service providers also bundle cable television and telephone costs together, make sure to use only the part that you use for business. Hint, television probably isn't an allowable deduction. Telephone costs. This can include cell phone and regular phone. Some jurisdictions may say reasonable and fair use if you use your regular home phone for both business and personal use. I say may allow it, so it's probably better to get a separate phone line for your business. Equipment costs. You obviously need a computer to run an internet business. Usually this is depreciable based on a percentage. But you can also deduct office furniture, such as your chair and your desk. Education costs. This would be any books or courses you take that are relevant to your business that can help you further your income. This list is again a general guideline. Always check with your accountant to get personalized and specific advice.